Hello, good. Miss Avalon? Like I say, you said you your stepfather would be a four. Hey, 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 that, that is not how it works. Well, then tell me how it works. Please, please, if you could just tell me how you convinced Jason to forgive you, then maybe I can figure out a way for Lucky to forgive me, too. Um, I don't, I don't know how any of this applies to you, but one day I just stopped. Okay, I, I just took a deep breath and I realized my life was all about anger and resentment and guilt. And every day I was taking myself deeper and deeper into a place that I didn't want to be. And I decided I didn't want to be that way anymore. So I took a step back and I, I realized that I had to take control of my life. So I started taking better care of myself and I made amends with people whenever I could. I gradually had to rebuild my life, and somewhere along the way, I actually learned how to respect myself. I know, it took time, trust me, and it had absolutely nothing to do with Jason. I didn't even think Jason and I would ever get back together. I don't think it ever would have happened if I hadn't found some, well, self-respect. I didn't want to believe that Sooner Jason would actually kill you, but after what happened to Dante, I had to say, I, I thought that could be wishful thinking. The only reason I'm alive right now is because the cops are all my son's ass for Claudia's murder. Yes. You have to have some self-respect, no matter if you're a man or a woman. It's that self-respect that helps you and gives you that lift up. You have to have self-respect. Whether you're a man or a woman, that self-respect in the end lifts you up. Because you have to have self-respect in order to have a relationship with somebody else. You really need that love. You have to have, you gotta have self-respect. You need that lift if you're gonna have a relationship with another. You need some self-respect. Oh yes, you do, you need. Some self-respect you have to have some self-respect. Oh yes, you do to have a relationship with another. Oh yes, you do. You don't really want. I mean, you shoot someone who saved your life and your little boy's life just because he's a cop. And so he regrets what happened. The only reason I feel sorry about all this is because Dante is his son. And look what Dad did to Claudia. How can you call him a good man? He's a thief. He terrorizes people into doing whatever he wants. How can you call him a good man? Okay, first, at first, the choices that your dad would make were all about survival, and they would only affect him. I mean, you, you knew that Sonny grew up poor, right? So naturally, he wanted money. He was powerless. He wanted power. A lot of people want power, but they don't go around shooting people. You're right, but you have to understand how Sonny was raised. He was raised in constant fear, and I think a lot of decisions he makes now are based on that. You mean he's afraid? No, I mean that he wants to make sure he's never afraid again, so he always strikes first. And he always wants his children to be safe because he never felt safe as a kid. Look, I, Sonny knows that he's made a lot of bad choices, and he's paying for them. He wasn't in a coma for a year. He gladly would have been. For Michael or for Morgan or for you for that matter. Maybe you want to believe that. But I just don't know if it's true. I know it's true. But I can't tell you how to feel about your dad. You have to figure that out for yourself. But I'm going to tell you all the mistakes that he's made. He'll never stop loving you. I mean, even if you want to cut him out of your life, he's always going to be there waiting for you. Hey. Is everything okay? I just needed some 
sponsors from Jason. Uh, not sure I was any help, but... You were. I still don't know how to feel about my father, but at least I'm beginning to understand who he really is. You wanted to see me? Yes, today is my day to deal with vengeful sponsors. And guess what? You're next. <laughs> you know what it's declaring war on. Oh, maybe you're good for a thrashing when I've had a bad day, but beyond that, don't flatter yourself. You're not taking sides? Oh, I never said that. See, I don't buy the whole tortured prince thing. To me, you're just a spoiled, selfish pig who takes what he wants. You put all this misery in motion. Yeah, well, I think we're all clear on that. You pulled Elizabeth into an affair. You made it impossible for her to do her job and then suspended her without pay. I realize that, but I'll cover any expenses she may have. <laughs> That's bloody noble of you, isn't it? Elizabeth's in pain, okay? I found her in Luke's office this week, staring at a flyer she crumpled up. <laughs> she tried to cover it, but she's barely keeping it together. It was a flyer. What, the, what difference does that make? Tell me what it was. <sighs> it was for some special for Valentine's Day we're having at the start. She was raped on Valentine's Day. Elizabeth was raped. She was 15. Lucky was supposed to take her to a dance that night, but he stood her up. She was alone at night in the park, and, and Lucky found her after it happened. Hope to put her life back together, and that's how they fell in love. And knowing all of that, you had to break it up. It's a difficult day for her, and even worse this year. Uh, knowing all that you had to break them up Oh no 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 Knowing all that you had to break them up They had a future together But you broke that up for them Didn't you? Of course you did yeah. uh -huh. Oh, whoa, 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 now, 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 oh, whoa, 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 knowing all that you still had to break them up now, didn't you? Oh, they had a future together. When she got raped, Lucky was on scene And helped make her safe Knowing all that, knowing all that You still had to break them up, didn't you? I don't want your money. What I need is for the two of you to put in a good word for me for the 